know. All right, we're gonna do another solo run challenge. But before we do, let's make sure our mods are turned off. Okay, workshop modding center, that's off. Okay. Let's do another try. Welcome if you're joining me. If you're just here to fall asleep, that's absolutely fine too. <laughs> my goal for this stream is to get really hydrated when you see my model do wonky things. It probably means I'm drinking. But water is really hard to animate, so we just went with body doing weird things. Let's go with 60 days until the ceasefire, a longer day. A longer time. It's okay. We're gonna start... Helena, our daughter from last time. We're gonna start with me. I am a forester. Let's have winter come early. Let's have it be pretty severe. Oh. No, I really want the mods. Uh, let's have it be moderate. So, we need to go ahead and choose 16 locations. Let's load a map pack. I need one more. Warehouse, pharmacy, old town hotel, gas station. A lot of good ones. I'm going to go with garage because that's by far my favorite. And it gets me forever. <laughs> radio. Radio parts. Yeah, I'm sure. Lose my current progress. I didn't choose how difficult the war was. Hold up. <laughs> yeah, I'll exit. Hold up. I want it to be really severe intensity. Um, new story. Yes, I thought I had disabled the mods. I don't want a story. Hi, kitty. Thank you for thank you for lurking. <laughs> if you pass out, you pass out, but I appreciate that you're here. I have to restart the game to apply changes. All right, you know what? But then I'll keep these. I'll keep these. High. Severe. Early. Rack. And to make up for the fact that I'm going to have those. No, I'm still choosing the garage. Uh, the garage was already there. It... Oh, this is a different pack. That's why. Um... Let's choose the one that... Yep, we have our locations. Let's choose the one that we got Marco killed at last time. Yeah. That'll be good. Let's go ahead and make the winter length... A little longer? Just a little longer for that. Uh, Alright, let's start. See, we have. This is not a bad house. I enjoyed this one. All right, looks like my character is coughing. 
Okay, is sick. Yep, I expected that. Let's see what we can find. First thing we're going to do is get heaters ASAP. Here's I'll take. I'll leave the parts. If I find any medicines, I'm going for the medicines. It's barred from the other side. Why did we go that way? That's a lot of questions. Definitely can use those to make a weapons shop, which is what we want. And as is often with this game, it is a long setup and then it just kind of goes quickly by the end. Uh, I have enough gears for now, so I'll leave them. Shop would be good, but but I really need a way to clear out these piles of debris. That's going to be the most important first. Also, it got really quiet in this game. you all can hear it. If you can't, please let me know. That's not where I thought I took you, but okay. Right now, trying to plan the best place for rat traps. Might be up here. Although I really like to have my beds up there. Hmm. Couldn't tell you. It's just personal preference. I couldn't tell you. There's no reason for it. Couldn't tell you why. something we need. We don't need it quite yet. We need it when someone's going to spend the night. A bed we will need. I regret not having one last time. Uh, I needed it much earlier on. So I'm trying to learn from my experiences. Let's see. I think that's a good thing. Door's locked. Oh my goodness, there are gonna be a lot of them, aren't there? Let's go. Last time I was like, let's leave things in the piles. And then my second character was clean. So if we get a child again, we need to be ready to go.
Even though the kid can't do anything to defend themselves, we absolutely need to be ready to go. Just in case. a four-hour endeavor with their hands. <laughs> hey, Saffles! Welcome to the stream! We're trying to learn from our past mistakes. We prepare for the entry of children, should they arrive. medicine. Electronic parts, but no medicine. So let's... Oh, that's locked. Okay. There's not much we can do. Wait. Preparing... Wait. No, I'm sorry. I meant preparing or learning from past mistakes. Preparing using our past mistakes as reference. No. <laughs> well, that's on me. Okay. Ghost house. Winter's gonna come really early, so we're trying to get as much wood and materials as we can to upgrade our heaters. Mostly what we're we're doing on day two. We'll need food. We have a bed, we have one heater. We'll need to upgrade as quick as we can to get electronic parts. so that we can get a thermometer to upgrade those heaters. And I'm kind of praying that we're not going to get another kid, but if we do, I gotta take the kid, so... I will say that's the thing that makes this game easier, is you learn what to expect. Your first run through might go really bad. Um, I didn't understand that keeping Bruno away from cigarettes, for example, would make him so sad. I've never smuggled through the boat before. Okay, door is locked. I do not have something that can take care of that, so... Take 
here. Yeah, stacking the wood like that is definitely a mod. It's not... It breaks the game a little bit, hence why everything else got modified as well to be a little more intense. I don't think I'll see Marco the next day. Not Marco, uh, Bruno, but Franco, Franco. But if I do, I'll just take that cigarette. All right, Rack is back. Diet was calm. What do I need? That's not bad. Actually used up a lot of our sources. Yeah, that's on me. Uh. Well, it is what it is. We can go there, that's good. It's gonna take us a while, so I'm gonna watch to see if anyone comes to the door. locked too, that's what me. I should not have upgraded that, but that's okay. I'll go ahead and sleep. <laughs> Rethink my life decisions. Being well, let's end the day. No one's coming. Um, St. Mary's Church. There probably are some things we could get there. Uh, Semi detached house, old town, ghost house has materials, but we just took all we could get for now. go. Old Town is a little dangerous. But I'm gonna go. Right, so if you were playing this blind, you're like, well, what's so dangerous about it? And I know. In fact, there is someone who comes back who lives here. I don't remember what the trigger is. I 
want to say it's going upstairs. Okay, if I can't get through that door, then yeah, I'm gonna try and... No, I didn't want to sit there, but okay. That's a locked, okay. Can't go that way. There may not be much I can take. I want to say it's going through those all bars, but there's far less here than I thought I could take. Uh, the materials are very welcome. The materials are very, very welcome right now. I think that's it for us. I don't, we can't go past anything. We can't go past anything because we have no tools, so... Bye! We're also not going to get killed, so I'm okay with it. Totally fine not to get killed. Uh, Rack is severely sick, yeah. Lockpick. Crowbar works. The crowbar absolutely works. I'm sure there is medicine in one of these chests. Or storage units, wardrobes, cabinets. Things that hold things. Uh, not going to be able to get a shovel. That's okay. I wish we could have a shovel. It's just not gonna happen today. Um, actually, I'm gonna stay here to watch who comes, and then I'll go ahead and open that doorway. That'll be the last place I explore before I go down, eat food, hope I get medicine, and then sleep. Franco, where are you? Oh man, this is gonna be the hardest game, no Franco. That would be an interesting mod, actually. Franco doesn't come to your place. Like, 
like maybe other survivors do, neighbors come, but no Franco. Yeah, if he's not come by now, he's probably not going to. Um, no medicine. No medicine for Rack. Oh. A few things I can do. First thing is I can eat at least, because I don't have enough to make a... Keep eating all the food. Well fed. There's meds. Right, let's go take them. And then we can sleep. should sleep. A saw. I need a weapon part. Okay, I'm gonna make one of those tiny ones uh, in case the military base unlocks, because that's much better for my chances of success and not death. Success is really... There are lots of endings in this game, but success for me is not dying. No, I lied. You're severely ill, but you don't get to rest. Light again, sleep. It's gonna be a lot of inventory to do that. Shelled school. That'll do it. Homeless people have taken refuge inside the building. It's a good garage, yes. And a military outpost. Well, guess where we're going. We're really gonna look for meds and food as our first most. That's, that's a good measure of good success, Kitty. <laughs> that's a very good measure of success. I will absolutely need that as well. Okay, I have two more slots. I will have three. I'm gonna wait for this guy to go. <laughs> Kitty, you are so adorable. I love you. <laughs> no, I don't want to get out. I want your stuff. Give me your stuff. It's free. Hey. Well, I don't have food. But I will take the bandages. Oh yeah, and the water. Oh, and the weapon parts. Yeah, I'm gonna take a lot of things. Uh... 
as much as I want to keep the cigarettes for trading later. I think having weapons would be much better in the long run, especially if there's not a child. Uh, then it just helps somebody who's going to guard, especially if it's someone weak like Anton or Sveta. Kitty, you are texting like you are so sleepy. Okay. Rack is feeling better, but still sick, so that's going to go up and down. We have some wood, and we have a lot of weaponry, which works out. I still don't want to take too much. Uh, I will want this for firewood, but... show up, I'm sure. about who's going to come and when Franco's going to come. I also wonder how many of us, if Franco didn't come, how many of us would just end our days. Hold on, I'm gonna go look in the house to see what else I've got. I'm gonna leave you out there to the snipers, I guess. You don't get to come in the house. Someone is at the door. Not enough for the medicine. Alright, bye. I need to sleep. I'm gonna fill up my fuel tank. Oh, that's only five, my bad. Uh. I kind of need the shovel. Eh. Okay, we can do the shovel tomorrow.
We will take the bandages to... We'll take the bandages to the garage. Let's sleep. We're still tired. Still not the worst thing. Uh, as of this point, every like four days, we're gonna visit the military. Uh, we're just taking it out of the house so when we get broken into, which will happen. <laughs> which will happen. Um, they won't come for us. They, sorry, they won't be able to take it. Let's... I have bandages. I'd like that. I'm gonna take... Mostly that's what I want. Um, okay. Nope. I want the raw materials. Okay. Alright, then let's deal. Bye, matey. Thank you. I'm gonna crawl on top of your house now. Oh yeah. I'm getting a lot of stuff, but that's okay. I can always come back here later. More than anything right now. Take these and... No, I'll need that to break into my own house. So yeah, let's do that. Rent to exit. Next time we come, we can get more stuff. Hopefully. We got raided. Surprised? I very much kind of figured that's how it would go. Uh, shovel. the shovel. See if we get a person today. Like another survivor today. Or if we stay by our lonesome. There we go. Do 
That's the push I want. Anton, that's exactly why we got the gun. <laughs> yep, I'm coming. Exactly why we got the gun. Yep, that's fine by me. I'm gonna go sleep now. Anton's tired. Tough. I'm not gonna be able to break them out of that very tired for a bit. There's the radio, there's the thermal regulator, which we badly need. be able to make two. Because um, I think I have some parts still in the house. Or not, whichever. Medicine, that's good. Not quite what I was hoping for, but I'll take it. There we go, radio part. So before we make the other radio part, I'm going to make fuel, because if we don't, Anton could freeze to death. And I wouldn't. I do not want that. <laughs> Trying to go without any deaths this time. I'm pretty sure we can do it.
Got our thermal regulators. We just need to bring up a bunch of things. We'll just need to bring back a bunch of materials. And I could either go to the garage or I can try to find my luck elsewhere, which I might do. There's the school. <laughs> really doesn't like it when I drink stuff. Uh, there's the school. Which has things. We also have an unfinished ghost house. Ruin Viva. An airport, which will have a lot of materials. And you're gonna go ahead and scavenge. Sorry, I meant stay home. There. Okay. I'm gonna take this with me just because. The herbs I don't really care about. Okay, the water I don't care about. The herbs I don't. Right now, it's not important. But we're gonna scavenge for the rest. And. Anton's at least got a rifle! And 13 bullets he can use. And we still have bandages, so. materials that bring me joy. Uh, and some meds and bandages. We might need them. It might be a thing where we absolutely need them. Definitely we'll need to make a bed for Anton. We will need two heaters, but I think we should be able to upgrade them. And then it will just be having fuel. So the wood, then my character here, the coal will be uh, take that axe and break everything so that we have enough fuel. I need that too. Uh, I don't think Franco is coming tomorrow. Hope not. Don't need water right now. We will need. Well, we might. take the bullets to replace any if we should lose some. We can come back here and get more things next time. The diamond I'm gonna keep here. Yep, let's go. gears, but hopefully Franco shows up. If he doesn't, he doesn't. Okay, Winter's not here yet. Whew.
Rack is back to severe sickness. Yep, kind of expected it. Okay, so Rack's pretty much doomed, which checks out. Okay, sir. I'm gonna say we do. That should be there, and do we have enough for a bed? Nope. weapon pieces. Okay, we don't have those, so let's see if it is. I'm thinking, oh no, I just, I just got so much stuff, um, uh, now there will be no one to guard them. Oof. On the other hand, yep, do you want to help neighbors? to the garage. Oh, no, military base. Military outpost. We have nothing to trade, but hopefully there will be medicine. And then garage. Yup. We will see. No, I'm gonna go with garage. I don't know, I don't know what I'm gonna go with because I need medicine, but I also need materials. Maybe the school would be the best bet. My hope is that there's medicine in the cabinet upstairs. But I don't have enough water for that, so it doesn't matter. Okay.
have two very exhausted people. And we're probably going to have Franco tomorrow. I almost wonder if Rack should stay home. Like, it's not going to help us in the long run, but it will protect us. Uh, Protect what's in the house. Nope. Oh, that's been answered. That's not happening. Ghost house does not really have the medicines. Military outpost does, but they don't really don't really have much. I'm not super desperate right now. Yeah, take what I. my food. Uh, let's keep that. Maybe we won't get robbed. We will totally get robbed. I don't know why I'm pretending that we won't. Um, that can stay. We can trade those for more materials because we'll need them. But there's no way to get meds here. That's the issue. Look to see if he has anything. <laughs> Additionally, I've done myself a disservice. Because there's no easy place to put stuff. Grabbing some things. Some things. It is really cool looking. I know you can make it even more pencilized uh, through a filter.
but I appreciate how they kind of make it a very gray uh, how do I say they make it very gray and difficult to see without they do vision loss really well that's what I'm trying to say this looks like stuff I could use I'm not gonna lie I'm really tempted to use one of those by trading for tomorrow. Because Franco should have medicine. I feel like my cutoff time is like 1.30. I gotta go. Um, while I want the electronic parts, I need to get all the materials to make another bed because I have two very exhausted people. I think I need to eat it and just say, yeah, we'll come back here later. It is a really bad combo to have. <laughs> I got some sleep, but not much. When I come back, I'm going to be like really hungry, still severely ill, if not terminally ill, and then I'm going to be like exhausted. I don't have any water to cook food, but I'll have to eat them raw. Yes, this is what I thought. We are pushing him really hard. Uh, Anton brought back water. They stole water, so it worked out. They stole some of our fuel. Because of course they did in our books. Um... but we have a lot of meat. That's really good. There 
there's an axe. We're gonna go chop a lot of wood suddenly. Who is this person? Okay. Rack's gonna sleep. Anton, get up there. Someone, we we got brought a gift. Probably. Let's go. And then we gotta make your bed. I can promise you hands down whatever you have to give us we need we need <laughs> yes that's really lucky thank you really lucky to get meds The other, like, the immediate thing, Saffles, is that uh, if I don't get, if I don't get fuel and I don't raise the temperature, they will freeze to death at night. You go back there. Uh, when they become severely exhausted, they just pass out wherever they are. That's not going to be an issue, except, except if tomorrow both of them are severely exhausted. They won't be able to put more fuel into the fire and keep it above freezing. Because I can, I don't know where I scavenged, but because we have medicine now and we have some fuel, I'm very tempted to have one of them guard and one of them stay home. Uh, sorry. One of them guard and one of them sleep. We'll see. Uh... Exhaust, both are exhausted. I'm going to have Wreck, Sleep, Anton Guard. No. Oh, I can't get to the military in post. Snow. Okay, you know what? I'm going to have both of them sleep. Maybe no one will come because of the winter. Um... Rack is still sick, but hey, they're alive. That's what I want. Will she really come here? No, she won't. Get your bed. Now they're just tired. That's much better than before. Mom. 
much better than before. In the winter time when it gets this cold, uh, often raiders don't come. But it is always luck of the draw. And while the military outpost is no longer an option. Really hoping Franco comes today so we can finish upgrading the other other furnace. And with our beds and our furnaces set, then we can finish, you know, figuring out the shelter. And once the shelter's figured out, then we can think of ways to trade for money, make money. It's a much harder start when you've got one person. Yep, there's Franco. some things we can trade. We still have a gun. We have Moonshine, which we grabbed specifically to trade. Uh, want to get the medicine, but I want the because I want the fuel. That's what I want. That's so expensive. That's way too expensive. I'm gonna go back on our food. Everything else can. Yeah, what if we take ten of the bullets? There we go. Alright. Goodbye. Thanks for joining us. Let's upgrade this. Let's upgrade. to a nice, balmy 30 degrees or 70, around 70-ish Fahrenheit. With two of them, with them being upgraded, I'm not so worried. Out. I'm not so worried about like freezing to death at night. Okay. Hey, Anton. Why don't you go ahead? Okay, and 
then rack and sleep. Anton will just go ahead and fill up the holes in the house. I'm really glad we got a gun from the outpost before it closed up. And he's just fixing up the holes, which is good because it makes it easier to defend. Let's see, is Rack not tired? Nope, she's still tired. She'll stay that way for a while, probably. Can I put six in? Yes. Then I will. We don't have any. That makes sense. So today. Guard, scavenge, old town is where we went. So that's where we're going. Hey. Yeah, we need the materials. Let's go. I'm going to take the axe with me. Go ahead and put all the good stuff. Oh. I don't know what I'm doing. Put everything in this big pile. Everything in the big pile. easier to do. No longer tired, that's a good sign. Now I can run. I should bring a shovel at some point.
What does this note say? A lot of stress. Seems Robert can't cope with it anymore. His mind is breaking under the pressure. He's becoming violent. Today, he was very harsh with Tatiana. Only because she drank one glass of water more than her share. I'm afraid war might change him even further. I'm not sure I can rely on him anymore. We'll try to leave the city. I've already made some arrangements. Love, Nadia. It is stressful. People do not always do well in life or death, and... That's, I think, to be expected. everything. Hey, look, there's another axe. Wait. Did, did we get another axe? No, we didn't. We have a shovel now. We can shovel! That's what we're gonna do. scared me. There is, in fact, a sniper. That was, in fact, a warning. can leave some of this. We can come back for some of it, especially. Especially since we're going to have a lot of things from it. And, yep. What do we have? Goodness, 15 fuel. Yeah, we're going to come back. But we're good for now. So out we go. Glad we didn't get shot. We. <laughs> I look so dumb anytime I drink. A lot of stuff. We were raided, but they didn't steal anything. That's what we want. All right.
on. Enough water. Okay. Still okay. We will collect some snow then. Everybody runs around. but now we can make more water, so... Thank you for the coffee, sweetie. I will drink it, probably, and go crazy with it. Using the cold to keep myself warm, uh, to keep myself alert. Clearly, it's working. So working. Absolutely going to need to get to the garage, so. It's been a bit. Let's take some things with us. We're going to need some water. What do we still have? Oh, yeah, that's beautiful. All right, that's lots of water. Okay. Tobacco for rolling. Consumables I love. Okay, we're at generous, so... Have a saw blade somewhere, so let's go ahead and keep the gears. Yep. Ah. 
I'm gonna keep two in there so I can continue to use that as a drop-off point if I need it in the future. Day 10. We are one-sixth of the way there. Also, Kitty, I guess this means you haven't fallen asleep, huh? choice right now that will eventually turn into meds that we can use to trade with the garage because that's the only way I do this playthrough ever. <laughs> it's the only way I play this game. Is either steal from the military and make an economy based on that or trade with the garage. And give the leftovers to the hospital. You get back up there. You are still hungry. your mom kids yes I stopped it just in time yes <laughs> we're gonna need canned food for those kids oh. <laughs> we're gonna need such medicine and canned food um Just keep doing what you're doing. Fine. Big stretch. Ooh, maybe I do need that coffee. <laughs> say when you're not running for your life all the time and worried about owls coming to capture you and eat you yeah it's much easier to sleep Anton, roll up those cigarettes. 
You can do it. Well, no. Stay in your bed. Anton's gonna go... Honestly. Finish using the fuel. Getting these upgraded is a necessity. You need two when it's severe cold, but it just makes the fuel last so much longer. But resource allocation is the whole frustrating part of the game, right? What do you need to spend your energy on? What do you need to spend your items on? Could go to the old town. I'm gonna go to the ghost house. Mm. No, I'm not. I'm going to old town. Hi, kitty. Meow, meow. Meow meow. Are you gonna help me with my stream? Yeah, you're gonna help me with my stream? You don't know what that is, do you? Do you want food? Yes. Yes. That was a very much a yes. doing that cat thing where you're planning to do something but you're not sure if you should commit but you're just investigating it right now just commit just commit have a cute little meow meow on my lap. Hi meow meow. Except you don't meow so much. You purr. Yeah? Cute little purr purr. We were raided. We used up ammunition. I don't know when... My character is not gonna get sick. I'm just gonna be sick this whole playthrough, it'll be fine. Uh, very hungry, very tired. Really great combo. Well, we'll have you sleep then. Thank you, Tiny. Thank you, Tiny Cat. It's a Franco day. Franco, you're gonna wait for a second. I wanna finish doing this hat. It looks really cool. Thanks for waiting. 
appreciate it. Just come inside, Franco. canned food. Okay. Hey, really wanted that. All right, there's still a place we can get it. Probably go to the garage to trade for it. Yeah, I actually want meat. serves it the most. Sleep, sir, eat. days ago. Oof. The school will have not food. Issue. The airport will have also not food. The supermarket will have food, but also we'll have an event there. getting to you just yet. So, to the garage it is. Hello, I need canned food. Thanks. That's a really good deal, actually. Um, cool. That's impressive. Sweet. All right. Let's go. It's quick. It's dirty. It's good. <laughs> That's not dirty at all. I gave you medicines I found in questionable places. Doesn't matter, they work. And now we have food for the children when they come back. But again, I...
if I didn't know what the children would need, I wouldn't, like, if this was my first playthrough, I wouldn't know to prepare for it. I am appreciative that it gives you a maybe later option, because not all of those quests give you that. He's hungry. Let's give you some food, sir. We don't even need to assemble it. There's no point. We don't have the cans of food are for the kids, not for the trap, so. <gasps> Hello. Katya. This is a great day. Go, my trading, trading queen. Yes, I need an extra pair of hands. Please. Uh, you're also sick. Okay, join the club. It's just gonna be a bunch of six people here. We do have beds, so that's where we're going. Everybody wants to have fun. I'm just bottomed out, sorry. <laughs> My voice doesn't go quite that low. being soft, purring. Adorable, adorable kitty. You remember the time I drugged you and flew you halfway across the continent? She does not. That's success for me. is absolute success for me. <gasps> Ghost house. If we need wood, we'll send my character out, the wood chopper out the next day. No, I already broke into this place. They didn't need to bring the song. That explains where my other saw went. I've been thinking, where did it go? It's in here. It's been in here the whole time. Another quick day. Honestly, I might go to the school next. Uh, and 
Anton got slightly wounded. Well. sure the kids will show up today. Oh, I should probably see what's going on in the world outside. Looters. People freezing to death. Everybody's going to sleep for a second. Okay, the kids may not show up today. That's fine. No matter what, if there's no food, then okay, we need to come up with extra food, is what it is. So let's do that. We can totally do that. great yet. It's okay. There's another saw blade we could have used. Ugh. Would have been really good. Uh-huh. Uh-huh, kitty. You're really sleepy, huh?
you think about pouring tacos and giving someone wrapped up coffee? I see. I mean, it makes more sense than mesh wire, so. So I understand. <laughs> Pretty sure it's underneath me if it's anything. But that's not great. <laughs> this fire. Uh, Franco's coming, so that's a good thing. I'm gonna leave. I don't think there's anything for me here. This is a bad call. I would like to not drink a, a taco or eat a coffee. I'm gonna have my water though. Thank you. Making lots of noise does not mean sneaky. Everyone is sad because they're so sick. Uh... I hate this. I'm saving the hands for the kids, but, but. It may not make any sense to do so. I think, Kitty, you're just making a lot of coffee puns right now. Coffee softly and carry a big taco? I think it's pretty obvious what you would like to do. Have tacos and coffee.
It's your time to shine, Karina. I... I like it. Thanks, Franco. What's it gonna be? I'm gonna wait for, like, another cigarette to be made. Two cigarettes. There we go. We need meds. For sure. We're going to need... Canned food. Maybe bullets? I might be okay till the next time he comes, so that's fine. Absolutely know that. I'm just waiting for Anton to finish making those cigarettes. We're gonna trade. We are. We are. Give me. There is no other food. Patty drinks coffee, so we should get a cup for her. Alright, coffee and a bullet for a pick little lock pick. I think that's a fair trade. Take your meds. Auntie is gonna take her meds. We're just gonna bed ourselves up. my children. All of them can numb my ear. <laughs> you have a greedy kitty. Oh, yeah, he did. Okay. 
that's not water. Aw, kitty, did you give a big yawn? Is that what I just heard from the other room? tired <laughs> it's absolutely fine to be tired and it's okay if you can't sleep even if you're trying and you can't sleep it's good that you're resting